Well look, we really don't know a lot about the genetics of this species, but a recent study that looked at 40 different rodents across Australia, including ones that are extinct, showed that central rock rats had one of the lowest diversity recorded, the second lowest diversity recorded. And that really confirms for us what we thought. The population is likely really small and critically endangered. Rock rat base to rock rat out. So we just hit our max take of critically endangered central rock rat to go to New Haven in the desert park. So good. <laughs> the central rock rat is critically endangered. There's thought to be less than a thousand animals in the wild and they were only rediscovered. They were thought to be extinct about 30 years ago. We've been setting a uh, hundred traps each night at each of our campsites through this mountainous terrain. It's been a really difficult week to get all this done and very thankfully it's been successful. There's the two components of the, the translocation. There's the direct wild to wild where animals are going straight to New Haven but then there's also movement of animals into captivity at Desert Park for captive breeding. We've had five trapping teams in remote locations. Each day we've been sending the helicopter out to pick up the animals that they've trapped the previous night. This translocation is significant. Where the animals will be released at New Haven Wildlife Sanctuary, the key threat, and that being feral cat, has been removed. So this translocation ultimately um, reduces the extinction risk for the species. Watching the helicopter come over the lip of the range was just an amazing experience. Um, knowing that we've got those really precious central rock rats on board was just a fantastic thing to see. And then having the helicopter land right on top of the range, it was absolutely spectacular. Here at New Haven, we have a fantastic um, setup. We've got an amazing feral predator proof fenced area, which is over 9,450 hectares. And within the middle of this uh, fenced area, we have this fantastic quartz range. And this is the ideal habitat um, for the central rock rat. We're able to control the main threats of feral predators, such as cats, and also um, uncontrolled wildfires. So through our conservation land management programs here on New Haven, we're able to create the perfect environment for the rock rats. Wonderful to have the central rock rat here on New Haven. The value of a collaborative project like this is it not only draws resources from different organisations, it also draws experience and knowledge and expertise from those different organisations. I don't think it's a coincidence that uh, this has been a very successful program because it's had so much uh, knowledge and experience across the board, different organisations um, really coming together to achieve that common goal. And that common goal of course is to try and improve the conservation status of this very rare critically endangered species. <laughs>